um, the last uh, panel uh, was in uh, so many so many uh, topics in, in there, but the hyper casual uh, is very very important for us. So today the other speech about uh, hyper uh, idealization of hyper casual games, uh, and uh, I invite Skyloft Vice President I2 Han, and here. Well. Thank you. Hi. The yes, stage is yours. Hi, everyone. Uh, my name is Aitu. In there. No, no. Alt tab basarsa. Alt aşağıda. Is it working? Yes. Yeah. Hi, uh, my name is Aitu. Uh, I'm working as a uh, DevOps actually uh, at Skyloft. Uh, we are mainly focused on hybrid casual at the moment. Uh, but, uh, and before that one, I was uh, co-founder of Video Games, and uh, Skyloft acquired us. Uh, now I'm working as a vice president for a year, also DevOps. Uh, so I will directly dive into the topic and not bore you. So for the tutorial part, we are always uh, avoiding using too much text and keeping it simple. And we never show users pop up. We, uh, we think that uh, it causes churn because a user may not find the X button or something like that. And uh, when we use text, uh, user bores, bores. For example, for China market, uh, for example, uh, for China market, we are uh, writing too much text because probably Chinese people r r uh, like reading. But for the US, they don't. So we are keeping it simple all the time. Uh, mechanic, uh, they are not playing, but uh, there is still GIF. Uh, so if they are not playing, I can't tell. But uh, feeling is the key. For, for example, when you are making joystick, uh, your finger uh, must uh, obey the touch. So if you are moving like this one, uh, p uh, the player should move. When you move like that, uh, the player should move. There was a bad example and good example, but somehow they are not playing, so I can't s explain more. Same here, like, give a player to the aim. For example, at this scene. Uh, Please use, use the microphone. Uh, it's really obvious that uh, player will collect the money and avoid taxes, like we all do. Uh, balance. Uh, we need to uh, flow the channel. If the game is too easy, uh, players will get bored. And if it's too hard, they will get frustrated. Uh, and first time user experience is really important. We made many ABs about this one. And we, uh, we, do, we don't want to overwhelm the user with the tutorials. And game need to be not too easy, not so too hard. And this, is, this was a, a sample scene. Uh, you can see that uh, this one, uh, player uh, is not obvious. And the platform is lost uh, because of the colors. Uh, and the objects are not sized well. Uh, this uh, statue is bigger than the car. For and for this one, uh, you can see that uh, platform is more close to the camera. And we can see the uh, player really easily. And the rewards are much more clear. Feedbacks. Uh, this is one of the uh, most important uh, part for us. We always uh, read our uh, feedbacks from the uh, store. They tell us a, a lot. M maybe players find the game, game too hard or too easy. So do not hesitate to check these feedbacks almost every day. And also, uh, let uh, people play your games. For example, I always let my father or sister play the game before testing. Uh, they tell a lot. You can even see that uh, they, you can even check their movements. Uh, where does he going? Where is he? What is he doing in the game? Bugs. Uh, it's the same. Uh, always do QA at your games. Every time. Even if you change a color, do a QA. And also check your store uh, uh, comments. Uh, maybe the player can't unlock it, can't, can't install it. We had a problem with the notification package, for example. 
uh, Unity uh, somehow pushed a broken uh, package to the store. And when we updated, it, game started to crash instantly. Uh, for a day, we almost used uh, 100,000 uh, player. And of course, churn. Uh, the fail rate of the first level should be almost zero. Because if the user fails at the first level, uh, they are quitting. This game is hard. They are thinking this game is hard. And also, churn rates should be no A B test. This is the uh, mo best part I love. We allow making A B test. A B anything. When you ch uh, if you want to change any ads or something like that, test it A B. Like you can use Firebase or even game anal analytics for that. Uh, run A B test this. Follow trends, but don't rely on them fully. Like the trend may, may be good, but uh, it can die easily. And also, if you make an A B test and it wins, it doesn't mean it is the best. Do the same test after two months or three months. The results can be changing. I think that's all. Yeah, thank you very much for listening to me. I will be out there smoking, so if anyone wants to talk with me, they can find me. Thank you. Yes, thank you. Uh,